Hi, I'm here to review the Civil Engineering Reference Manual, uh, the 15th edition from Michael Lindbergh. I used his FE book to pass my FE exam, and I'm eligible to take the PE exam, so I've been studying. And I want to make a quick review on this book. As you can see, I call it it's like it's like a Bible. It's huge. Uh, it has it has a lot of Subject is subdivided into general information, water resources, environmental, structural, everything that you need to know to pass that exam should be here. Now, from my experience, uh, starting from this book and from other sources, I can say it's a really good book, it's very comprehensive, has everything you want to know about everything. Now, do I recommend for the PE? Mm, maybe. Why is that? Because for the PE you need to be good at solving questions. Well, for any engineering test or engineering thing. You need to be good at solving things fast and effectively. And in this book, like, yes, it's really good. You will learn a lot of stuff. But a lot of this stuff is stuff that you don't need to know, if that makes any sense. Like, uh, like you don't care about, for example, higher grade equations when you don't have time to do that during a during the PE exam. So a lot of times a lot of the stuff that comes here is not that useful. So you should just skip over it. With that being said, this is a great resource for any engineer because a lot of fundamentals and stuff that you want to know are here. So this is a great book to have in your collection. Just because it, it can act as a reference when you need to be more specific. And it's also a good tool to study for the PE, but I wouldn't make it my only tool to study for the PE. Uh, what I've been doing, I've been just solving the problems that I see, and I read over every chapter or every section a little bit. And if I feel this is crap, or like this is something I'm not gonna use, I just keep that section, and I just go into the problems. I've been trying to solve every problem from every section that I've been reading. Right now I'm in the structural part, so that's what I've been reading, uh, because I'm gonna be taking the structural one hopefully in October or I don't know, whenever it comes out. Uh, this book goes for around $300, so it's expensive, but I do think it's worth it just because this is a resource that you're gonna use towards, like in, during your whole career. And like I said, it's very, very comprehensive. One thing that I do think my, I might do in the future, maybe just like scan or like make copies of the most important pages so that in this case for me would be the structure and just have like a mini booklet like uh, highlighted with important things for me and I think that's a good resource, a good thing to do also for the PE like if you're taking the structure or anything just have it as a booklet and like highlight the important formulas and stuff like that or even like you can bring this book to the PE so you just have, have to leave little like uh, sheets of paper with the main formulas uh, overall I'm happy with my purchase, I think this is a really good book uh, it's expensive, but I mean it's worth it. Like if you want to be a PE, the 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 increase in salary is more than offset by spending money on this. So I do recommend you to get this book if you're planning to get the PE license. Thank you.